What's up, YouTube? Jeff, your style OG. And on today's video, I'm going to share with you my picks for the 10 most underrated summer style items. If you're new to the channel, we release a new video every Monday, Thursday, and Saturday at 4 p.m. Eastern, discussing various men's lifestyle topics such as style, grooming, and dating. I invite you to subscribe, tap the notification bell, and join us. And to my returning friends like Jeffrey Wumasi, salute. Now, most of us have a general idea about some basic summer style items. You've got your cotton shorts, your canvas sneakers, your t-shirt, maybe even a lightweight pair of trousers. But what about some style items for the summer you might not have in your wardrobe? Some out of the box choices. That's what I wanna share with you on today's video. On today's video, I'm gonna discuss with you 10 of my picks for the best underrated summer style items. So without any further delay, let's hop right into it. First up on the list of the most underrated summer style items is absolutely one of my personal favorites. A style I've definitely been rocking a lot the last couple summers. I highly recommend you grab yourself one or two Johnny Collar Polos. What is a Johnny Collar Polo? A Johnny Collar Polo is a polo shirt that has a small round or pointed dress collar that has a front split and sits close to the neck. I believe this gives this kind of polo a very elegant, refined look. To me, a much more polished look than a typical polo with buttons on it. I think it has a sleek, streamlined look with that flat collar. I love these so much, I just recently ordered two more for myself. Want a sleek, elegant type of polo to wear this summer? Grab yourself a Johnny Collar Polo. Now we're staying in the shirt category for our next underrated style item. In fact, this summer style is so underrated, I hope I'm pronouncing it correctly. You definitely want to look into grabbing yourself a Goya Berra shirt. Now the Goya Berra shirt is Latin American in origin, usually made in Cuba or Mexico. And some of the features of this underrated shirt, it usually has two to four pockets and vertical pleats either down the front, back, or both. It's usually made of linen or cotton, is extremely stylish and very comfortable. Now like with a lot of menswear items, the Goya Berra shirt is workwear inspired, lending itself to have a very masculine feel. Now traditionally, you wear this shirt untucked and it has a straight hem. You can easily find the Goya Berra shirt in long sleeve or short sleeve options. I actually just ordered this one for myself. A great underrated summer shirt style, masculine, stylish, and comfortable. Looking to grabbing yourself a Goya Berra shirt. Now when it comes to your style, whether during the summer or year round, the final details can really make your outfit sing, especially your accessory. Thus, my next underrated choice. You definitely want to grab yourself a Panama hat. Now, just the fact that you're wearing a hat at all will make you stand out. Most people, besides wearing a baseball cap, really don't wear hats anymore. And a great underrated stylish pick for the summer, the Panama hat. Now, it may look like a fedora, and it often has the same shape or style, but there's a main difference. The Panama hat is constructed out of Tokoya straw, a fine grain straw. This straw in the Panama hat makes it lightweight, makes it breathable, giving you the same style and look as a fedora, but much more warm weather appropriate. I also like that the Panama hat is very portable. You can bend it and it often can go back right to its original shape. Keep the sun off your face in a very stylish way. Grab yourself a Panama hat. Now next up, we have our first shoe on our underrated summer style list. I absolutely love this choice, one of my favorites for the warm weather. You should look into grabbing yourself a pair of driving shoes. Now, what makes a shoe a driving shoe? It's a leather or suede moccasin with a rubber grommet heel. Now, the driving shoe was originally invented for guys who were driving nice sports cars and wanted more grip. Thus, the rubber grommet sole couldn't be contained within the automobile. A lot of you sophisticated, elegant guys started making the driving shoe part of their summer shoe rotation. To me, the driving shoe is a casual shoe with elegance, refinement, and sophistication. Wear it with trousers, wear it with chinos, wear it with shorts. Want a refined, sophisticated shoe for the summer? Grab yourself a pair of driving shoes. Now, of course, no question, a lot of guys like rocking shorts during the summer, but oftentimes they'll choose cotton shorts. I want to give you a more elevated, elegant choice, in my opinion. Look into rocking linen shorts. Now, of course, the number one fabric to wear during the summer is linen. Why? Because it's lightweight, it's breathable, it's airy, it's comfortable, and it's highly absorbent. It only makes sense to wear it with shorts. And I love the fact when you rock linen shorts, in my opinion, they just come off a little more polished than their cotton brother. No doubt the lightweight, breathable fabric and the polished look of the linen shorts gives you the best of both worlds. 
form and function. To me, the number one short choice for the stylish guy, grab yourself a pair or two of linen shorts. Now next up is an underrated style item for the guys out there who have this in common with your boy. I love to wear boots year round, including the summer. The best boot choice for the summer, a suede boot. Now hey, I love a leather boot just as much as the next guy. But if you're gonna rock a boot during the summer, it should be suede. Here's why. Suede is more lightweight and more breathable than its leather counterpart. What are some great choices when it comes to a suede boot? You might go with a chukka or two of my other favorites, a jodhpur or a Chelsea boot. And during the summer, I like to err on the side of lighter colors, especially a nice beige or sand suede boot. The suede boot is one of my favorite choices for summer nights in general, but specifically a summer date night. I actually wore a nice pair of suede boots with some white jeans when I went to the movies the other night with my lady. If you're a year-round boot wearer like myself, make sure you make the right choice. Air on the side of suede boots. Speaking of white jeans, brings me to my next underrated summer style choice. You definitely wanna grab yourself a pair of white denim. Now, if you've been watching this channel for any amount of time, you know I'm a huge proponent of white jeans. I love the clean, minimalistic look. They're a summer staple for a reason. And for a lot of guys who reach for jeans no matter what time of the year, they're a better choice than your traditional jeans, your dark, heavier jeans. And the clean, minimal look of the white jeans makes them easy to dress up or dress down. I love to rock them with loafers, boots, driving shoes, you name it. Now I get it. I know a lot of you guys are scared of the white jeans. Oh, they're gonna get dirty. If you're scared, get a dog. But if you want a nice underrated pair of stylish pants for the summer, grab yourself a pair of white jeans. Now next up on the list, we have another underrated shirt style. And it just so happens to be the one I'm rocking right now. I highly recommend you grab yourself a band collar shirt. I absolutely love the band collar shirt. I think it's sleek and sophisticated. Think of it as a dress shirt minus the collar. Band collar shirt gets its name because it has a band of fabric around your neck as opposed to the traditional collar, making it sleek, sophisticated, and less likely to overheat you because you don't have that fabric on your neck that a traditional collar has. It help keeping you cool literally and figuratively. This is also one of my favorite choices to wear on a summer date night. Oftentimes you'll find them in linen or cotton, two of my favorite fabrics when it comes to a band collar shirt. Looking for a sophisticated, underrated shirt to rock during the summer? I highly recommend you grab yourself a band collar shirt. Now sometimes during the summer, either from necessity of having to, or you just want to, you're gonna have to rock a suit. But your year round traditional wool suit, just too hot. Instead, you need to invest in a summer suit. Now the difference between a summer suit and your year round suit is usually a couple of things. First of all, the fabric. A summer suit is gonna be more lightweight, more breathable, often made of cotton or linen. Oftentimes your summer suit is gonna be different in this way. It's gonna have little to no padding and no lining. Think of an unstructured jacket. This lack of padding and lining, along with the lightweight breathable fabric, makes it much more warm weather appropriate. Because the summer suit doesn't have the lining, the padding, or the heavy materials, it lends itself to more casual suit looks. Perfect for the summertime. If you find yourself in a situation where you have to or want to wear a suit, make sure you have a summer suit. Now, one of the beauties of wearing a summer suit, you automatically know it matches. The jacket and the pants go together, which leads nicely into our next underrated summer style choice. You might wanna look into grabbing a short set. Now, when I started this channel a few years ago, a short set is something I definitely never thought I'd recommend. You see, as I was growing up in Philly, we thought of the short set as the old guy uniform. You see a lot of the brothers in Philly rocking a polyester or rayon short set with a baseball cap turned to the back. However, sometimes you gotta think outside the box. The short set is actually on trend now, especially if you look at some of the modern interpretations a lot of the younger fellas are doing. It kind of looks to me like a nice, grandpa steez. Whether you're talking about grabbing a short set in a solid color or a bold pattern, the short set is a great way to have a coordinating look during the warm weather months. You see, one of the keys about underrated style items, they help you think outside the box, including me. I never thought I'd say this, but I'm recommending to you and to me a short set. Now that was 10 great underrated summer style items, but now I have a bonus recommendation. Now, when it comes to your style year round, one of the things that can set you apart are those final details, like your accessories, or in this case, your fragrance. You definitely wanna grab yourself a summer cologne. Now, to me, a fragrance becomes even more important during the summer. 
That's because we have less style options, we're wearing less clothing. How you smell stands out even more, especially if you keep into consideration that 80% of guys don't wear fragrance at all. Just the fact that you sprayed on a summer cologne sets you apart. Now the type of cologne is very important. During the summer, you wanna reach for fragrances that are light, bright, fresh, crisp. Think citrusy, think marine, think aquatic. If you need some help picking a great summer cologne, I'm gonna leave a link in the description of my 10 best summer colognes for this year I recently published. But whether you choose a fragrance from that list or another great summer cologne, a great way to stand out, grab yourself a summer fragrance. Now, as I mentioned in the beginning of the video, a lot of us already have the summer basics down. But I wanted to give you some great underrated summer style choices that will help you think outside the box and step your summer style up to the next level. Now, as always, I love to have your input. Let the Stylogy family know in the comment section if you have some summer style favorites that tend to fly under the radar.